What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Landaris. You already know. You see it. You see it. LNL Line Service, Kansas City, Missouri, Blue Springs area. Mm-hmm. Back at you. Hey guys. Got a yard that I'm doing. Finishing up. Just gotta blow it off. A little edging done. But the thing about this yard was he hasn't cut his yard since the season started. Been growing it for weeks, right? Been growing it for weeks. So, and since he's been growing it for weeks, it was over at least six to seven inches back here where I had to uh, cut it three, three times and then rake it and bag it up and then do the trimming. But yeah, I don't know why some customers kind of try to uh, grow their grass so high, you know, and then think that they're going to get a regular cut. This is almost like a cleanup as far as a spring cleanup price because you're mowing three or four times. Now you got to get and you got to bag it. You got to put it in the bag. I had about four, four bags of grass. And i tell you what, when you put grass clippings in bags, freaking heavy probably about 40 to 50 pounds a piece they're back there i got four of them four bags of clippings that was just from the backyard guys and then i tried to distribute the leftover grass as much as possible but this whole yard was overgrown and some customers just think that they just keep growing that grass, growing that grass, and it's green, green, green. But you're gonna do more damage to it. Now, especially if I didn't bag it. You have some companies, some some companies will come over here and they'll just they'll just cut it and be pissed off because you let it get so long. But this job is gonna probably be about 175 I might 185 maybe 190 once I calculate you know the bags and, and how much time I took to do it it's probably going to be about 190 for the first cut so I don't know all right guys just wanted to share that with you so if you ever come upon customers that let their grass grow high in the beginning of the season and let it get over five inches six to seven inches which is what that backyard was i cut this on five and it's still high so uh you can just imagine what it looked like in the backyard so charge accordingly heck i should be charging a 225 i should be charging this butt 225 but this guy has me aerate, overseed. Um, so um, I get business here. So, but yeah, minimum 175 to double, triple cut. And there's no way that you can leave those clippings in the backyard. That's why I had to get them up. I had to get them up. It was so much loose grass back there that you got to get it up. You got to get it up. As a professional, you would have to get it up. Now, um, just to make it look decent, make it look right, and not kill off the grass, because there was too much grass back there. All right, guys. Like I said, just wanted to share, share that with you. Hey, subscribe to my channel. Uh, I'm slowly moving along. I think I'm on 700 and uh, seven something the upper 700 uh, subscribers. Uh, subscribe to my channel. All right, guys. Like, subscribe. Hey, leave your comments. Hit that bell button.
do whatever you got to do. And just leave in the comments, what do you charge for overgrown grass uh, when customers let it get too high, especially in the springtime? Like I said, this grass was probably seven, seven, maybe seven to eight inches, at least seven inches high in the back. And there was no way that I could leave that grass back there. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next video.